There's only one way to reach Wat Khun Samat Chin. The Buddhist temple is now an island. Once it was the center of a thriving village on Thailand's central coast, but the rest of Samat Chin has been drowned by the sea. Homes and farms have disappeared as sea levels have risen. Electricity poles poke out of the water where the road used to be. Old video shows homes being broken up by the waves and the temple awash. Today, a handful of monks still live here, keeping the temple alive as a place of worship. There used to be a school in front of the temple, but it was destroyed by the rising water. The people who lived here moved away, but the temple can't move, so we stay here in the middle of the sea. The temple floor has been repeatedly raised. It's now two meters higher than before. Water damage is plain to see, but the Buddhist artifacts survive. Those living here have had to move their homes inland many times. To reach them, you have to cross a series of rickety wooden bridges. Scientists say the sea has risen more than two meters and forced its way over a kilometer inland over the past 30 years. We all think about moving out, but some of us have been here a long time and don't want to go. It would be hard to start again. Only those who have money can start a new life somewhere else. A combination of climate change and land subsidence has made coastal erosion at the top of the Gulf of Thailand amongst the worst in the world. At the next 20 years, if we are no any measure, it's about 1.3 kilometers more we will load. We invest. And if we are thinking, I calculate in the scientific way, 50 years, 50 years is about uh, 2.3 kilometers more. And uh, 100 years, about 6 to 8 kilometers. It means uh, we are lost land more. This one is serious. Sea levels here are rising at between 5 and 10 times the global average. It's quite shocking to think an entire village has been completely submerged by the sea. But perhaps even more alarming is the fact that Thailand's capital, Bangkok, which itself is only one and a half meters above sea level, stands just 50 kilometers inland from where we are now. Some argue climate change remains unproven. But at Samut Chin, they're not interested in debate. They're too busy trying to hold back the sea. Martin Lowe, CCTV, Thailand.